pitch Indeed, now, Eddie, midweek. You're, you're, you're an experienced sports journalist. You, you cover these things for years. Can, can I ask you, have you ever had a mouthful of cinnamon? <laughs> no, I haven't. It is driving me mad. <laughs> uh, if anyone has ever experienced this, can you please call or text in 08717 or, or text me on 1889 if there's some sort of... I'm rushing off it. I'm buzzing off cinnamon. Is this uh, is this a natural high or is this? Uh, am I in danger here? I wonder what the the antidote is. What, what's the um? I don't know. What do you do to uh, get rid of cinnamon out of your system? I don't know. Uh, snort vanilla, perhaps. <laughs> yeah, says Ali. Uh, I don't know. What is the antidote? To, well, what would? What's the opposite of cinnamon? Because that's that's. <sighs> I don't know. Do you lick a dock leaf or something? Yeah, I don't know. Nutmeg. N- nutmeg, perhaps. One of the yeah, producers yeah. is saying nutmeg. Sprinkle out a bloke called Graham. <laughs> Maybe give him a kiss. This is um, th- this is quite a peculiar experience. I almost feel like this is Channel Four Drugs Live, but the sort of <laughs> the losers version. Tonight, live on air, one person will take a mouthful of cinnamon. We will then follow uh, the progress, or others say hey, it's all feel shiny. I've got to be honest. It just I feel like I'm on the biggest sugar high of my life. What you need is a glass of water. I feel wired, man. I feel like I want to party. <laughs> Let's party. Let's, Let's get do some it. babes in here and party. <laughs> I've had cinnamon. It's like train spotting, but for losers, isn't it? Oh, God. <laughs> so I can't believe it. Uh, I've always heard it's good for your metabolism, so maybe it's just speeding everything else up as well. Is there just half left now on that? Uh, There's well, still a whole charge. You want to do it? <laughs> what? <laughs> yes, yes, and no. I <laughs> think. Oh, crikey. If anyone else out there has done the cinnamon challenge or is aware of the dangers of cinnamon, are there any? Help me out, please. Throw me a frickin' bone here. Or get in contact with Bobby Gould. I'm just saying that because I know we broadcast in America now and I'm trying to bring in our American cousins across the pond. Hey, guys, uh, you guys ever had, I don't know what you call it over there, simonium? Uh, Well, if you've had any simonium and, uh, you know, it freaks you out, (laughs) you know, Uh, get off your butt. And uh, uh, put down those Oreos and uh, get up the sidewalk and, and give me a call. Um, I'm sure they'll be flooding in now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, it's, it, we're, they're sort of five hours behind, so they'll, they'll all be out in bars now doing... Ci- I, mean, I tell you what, it's a lovely... Cinnamon shots, maybe. You know those bars that do flavoured vodka? Yeah. Cinnamon vodka. Perhaps. I'm sorry, Elliot. It's an idea, there. It's sport, an idea. I, 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 no, I'm, no. I apologise in advance for any of my behaviour throughout the show because... As you know, I've taken a substance here, and it may well... I hope people have just tuned in there and missed that. It's going to be like War of the Worlds all over again. (laughs) Um, What else is in the sports page? I'm sorry. I can feel it on my back. I can feel it (laughs) where the neck meets the back. It feels alive down there. (laughs) Yeah. I'm sorry, Elliot. Sorry, the sports pages, the sports pages. 